guys hi guys hi guys <laughs> welcome back to my youtube channel it's another day another video and this is the second episode of good wife i didn't actually even expect to record or to film this <laughs> this crazy episode because um i didn't intend to do it okay so what actually happened is I reached a milestone on my YouTube channel, which is thanks to you guys. I got 25,000 views and that really encouraged me. So I decided, you know what? I'm going to make my family chapatis, okay? So uh, to make the best chapatis, I had to make sure I was doing it right. And I did what? I headed down. Now that plane doesn't want me to prosper. Okay yeah so what happened is i went to the youtube channel and i looked for a recipe that was supposed to give me chapos with layers and multiple layers and <laughs> i am here to tell you that i made the chapatis and you're gonna see how they turned out because my god was it an epic fail okay it wasn't necessarily a fail but what out as yeah watch the video and see okay and if you haven't subscribed to my channel by now you're really not doing me justice you're really not doing me justice please hit the subscribe button it's free of charge nothing for you to lose you know so please hit the subscribe button and then let's get down to making the chapatis or oh my god don't judge okay i told you this is raw and filtered wifely life okay so i made chapatis okay and if you follow me on facebook you know i'm not the one who made chapatis in my household so let's see how it went down <laughs> yeah So I'll be using this recipe to make chapati zakarasi by Faith Happy Kitchen. You can check her out. She has amazing recipes. And yeah, so that is what I'll be doing today for dinner. Yeah, so. So I followed her recipe to the tea while making the dough. But then I skipped one ingredient. I think that is what messed up my chapatis because I didn't have it. I can't recall what she was calling it. You can just check it out on her channel. So I just used normal flour, salt, oil, and other things she said. And yeah, it was that soft after around 30 minutes. So I decided now it was time to make the chapos. And as usual, my son was there beside me doing what he does best, cooking with his mom. Yeah, so I hope you enjoy the video and... Leave a comment if you've ever had an epic fail in your kitchen. What did you do to redeem yourself? And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and let's do this. When you feel it's hopeless, when you think that you lost, oh, I will take your hand and we'll rise up from the dust. something just make sure they are the thinnest you can get to and this camera is interrupting my flow okay so yeah so you keep doing these all right yeah 
Yield them as thin as possible so that the layers can be as many as possible. Okay, so do that. And I feel like that is a very big chapati, so I'll use this one to make another roll. So I'll combine it with another one I had cut previously. Then using your knife, just, you know, pull this together in no particular, you know, at the order. You just need them to get over each other. <laughs> okay. Like you can literally see the layers already, even on the do. Yeah, so do that. I know it looks like it's something you can do using your hand, but a knife does it better. Coding to Faith. I owe all this knowledge to Faith. <laughs> Faith's happy kitchen is like my go-to place anyway when I really need a challenge. And chapati was my today's challenge. Being a good wife. Part of being a good wife. So once you're done rolling the layers over you just do this and yeah so so you do this with all your pieces as usual then uh we're not going to oh, um, um hmm. we all have our burdens yeah but we just keep on fighting that we never look back here we go 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 let us see Expectation versus reality. Reality. <laughs> I didn't get my layers, okay? I didn't get my layers. That said, the chapatis were so soft and sweet. I liked the taste of them and my family really enjoyed. Yeah, so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please don't forget to subscribe, share, and comment down below. Bye. See you in my next video. Thanks for watching once again. Bye-bye.